Point. Hey everybody, welcome back to Ready Steady Play. We are about to do what is probably going to be the finale of the final scenario from Dunwich Legacy. Holy shit. Uh, this is also down to the wire. Um, we've got almost no time left. Yep. Do it. And we've still got a lot to do. Also, I'm in a bad way. Danny and Barry are right. <laughs> but we've got one more mindless phase to survive <laughs> before we can make any important decisions. And I'm going to have two mentalness for the rest of the campaign. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, okay, good. So, yeah, we're in the darkened hallway. Uh, Barry's just heard a rumor that his sister might be in the bar, but he'd have to run back through the entire club, yeah. including past the servant of the lurker, to get to her. When does it hunt her? Is that only if it's awake? Uh, yeah. So it has to be uh, during the enemy phase, hunt her moves towards the nearest investigator. But... So there is a, a nasty monster in the card room, which is between Barry and his sister. Uh, we've also got potentially just one more turn because we're about to put another Doom token on Chaos in the Copper Club. That happens first, right? Yup. There we go. Boom. Six Doom. And a Mythos for Danny. Rats. Oh, it's rats. Uh, I mean, okay. Just have to take the hits, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> I've got rousing suspicions. Rousing. Well, the, nothing happens. Nothing happens. That's that, that's the best that I could hope for. On each criminal at your location, you lose two resources. Oh, okay. Well, that's so things do happen, but yeah, okay. swarm of rats. Rats. <sighs> like rats fleeing a sinking casino. Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Done. <laughs> Right, how are we going to round this one out? So it has to be resign. We're not going to... We can get the clues, So, but we don't have the time to progress. There's a third thing there, and we're not going to have time to... So Barry thing, yeah. I mean, so basically, the problem I've got is that I'm frozen in fear, which means um, all, all of the things that are sort of important to do now cost me two actions instead of one. Furthermore... My willpower is three. Frozen in Fear has a challenge rating of three. I have nothing that can boost my willpower. So there's just no way. Um, you know, I've got minus one because I'm cursed, which means there's almost no way I'm going to get rid of Frozen in Fear. And even if I did, by the time I did it, Chaos in the Clover Club would activate anyway. I need to finish this round. We need to finish this, this round. Um, and the really key thing here is uh, what Danny does because he's got four clues we need two more clues to progress uh there is one more doorway but i mean danny would have to get those two clues and then move back to the darkened hall to activate the last thing and then baron and i would have to be able to resolve it whatever it is um no resign. i cannot do anything <laughs> it's over the dream we didn't find anybody oh this is the second one in a row you guys <laughs> but it is pretty common for blind plays of these scenarios to... You're not going to get the perfect resolution. Yeah. Unless you're really good, and if you are, kudos. Um, <laughs> if you are, leave a comment to your... Yeah. Just go, uh, yeah, tell us how good you are. You, you scrubs, why did you obviously should have... Do you know what you shouldn't have done? Put that barricade down. I'll give you that. Yeah. That was one wasted action. Yeah. I don't know what I would have done instead of that. There was literally nothing yeah, else all you could have done. To... Like, everything else I need... I can't try to fix Frozen in Fear. That just happens at the end of my turn. Uh, the Eternal Injury I need two actions for. Yep. Yeah. Womp womp. Um, so do you know what the problem <coughs> here is now though, Barry? Um, I'm not even going to uh, get to try and fix my... I should have fixed my Strange Solution instead of Barricade. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Again. So um, I've got a whole campaign. But if I won that, I might have got rid of the Cursed Luck, which might have allowed me to get rid of the Frozen in Fear. Hello and welcome to the episode 7 of... <laughs> <laughs> Hello and welcome back to a uh, half an hour ago. <laughs> um, oh god, okay. You mean yesterday? Uh, yes, yeah, two yeah. days ago. <laughs> is what I meant. Alright, alright, alright. Right, let's finish it people. Yeah. Okay, what we will do probably I think is we will read the worst ending as well. Just to see what would well, have whatever, whatever ending we get. Yeah. Well, we'll definitely read that. Yeah. Yeah. 
Well, the, yeah, but we're going to resign, right? I mean, we have to. Yeah, but you still get an ending. You still get an ending from that. Because it's part of the game. It's part of the game. You do... Yeah, so, I know, but we'll read that first, and then maybe we'll read the worst we'll one. We'll take a look and see what was on the other side. Let's the, see the what we have won. All right, so um, I guess... Uh, well, I guess... Who wants to resign first? I feel you're in charge. Okay, then. Okay, here I go. Uh, that's two actions, three actions. I leave. Bye-bye. Pack up all your stuff. Okay. Packing up all Dan, stuff. show us your moves. All right, so I'm going to move down to the darkened hall. Yep. Rats are going to kill Pete. <laughs> <laughs> so long, Pierre. <laughs> Pete death one. Uh, then I'm going to move into this room. I'll take a hit from the rats. <laughs> And then I'm going to resign. Are they hunters? Do they follow you? No, well, they're, they're, they're engaged, engaged with me anyway. Uh, so um, You brought the rats with you. You've they're coming with crazy. me. And then I will resign and I'll probably take another damage from that. Yep. Duke has still not taken any damage. <laughs> good, good. Um, right. I prove. So you're done there. Me. Yep. Uh, one. Move here. Two. Let's punch him in the face. Chuck me the thingy. I take an attack of opportunity from the rats. Chuck it back. <laughs> what, are you, what are you doing? Don't worry about it, man. <laughs> <coughs> Hashtag YOLO. He's got his um, yeah. Move. So four, it's four v four. Come on, come you on! Absolute madman. Shazam! Um, That's a victory point, baby. No, <laughs> it wasn't all in vain. Oh no, it's not. It's not because only do one damage because I wasn't engaged with him, and he wouldn't have been the only person engaged with me. No. Yeah. No. <laughs> so you you nearly killed Porque, him. Okay, yeah. Was Are you going to uh, now? Right, then I spend two. I'll engage everybody. Go over here. Resign. <laughs> the end. Oh. oh no, I can't. Because that, is that a fast action? It's a fast action, but I can only go to a revealed location with no enemies. Oh no, you've packed all your cards up. I'm gone, the rats yeah, are gone. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, no! <laughs> I left the rats behind at the door. So we did yeah. get one victory point from exploring the back alley. We did get one victory point. Yep, yes. great. Uh, do you know what you can do with one victory point? Play a side quest. Mm. The Curse of the Rougarou, for example. Well, we could do that. Try and make back some of the... We might actually win one. That yeah. would be... I would like yeah. to win one. Yeah. Barry, do you want to read us the ending? Yeah, so... So this is the second least resigned. disappointing ending. <clears throat> Right, resolution one. So let me just uh, bust this out again. Do -do -do -do. Uh, if no resolution was reached, do this. You barely made it out of the club alive. You flee to the end of the block and pause to recover. Before you can catch your breath, the ground shakes with a thunderous crash. People emerge from their homes and storefronts to see what the ruckus is, and a crowd forms on the street. You head to the front of the crowd and they're horrified to see the building from which you fled just minutes earlier reduced to rubble. There is no sign of Dr. Morgan anywhere. Uh, in your campaign log, record that the O'Banion gang has a bone to pick. It's not our fault that they built their club on a clear sinkhole. Uh, yeah. It's not up to code, really. Uh, record that Dr. Francis Morgan is dead. Kidnapped. Kidnapped. Kidnapped by the ground. <laughs> Kidnapped by what? Well, we don't know. We didn't find out. If any player cheated, add a bad token to the chaos bag for the remainder of the campaign. A what token? Bad one. <laughs> uh, <laughs> each investigator earns experience equal to the victory value of each card in the victory display. One. Yay. Plus, each investigator earns one experience. He or she has perplex on the, that evening. So plus to XP. Well, it was certainly an experience. Yeah. Uh, but we didn't cheat. Why do we have to deal with the bad dog? <laughs> and then on to interlude one. So, check the campaign log. If investigators are unconscious for several hours, otherwise skip to two. Right, when you arrive at Dr. Armitage's home in Southside, you find him sitting at his desk, pale-faced and sweating with worry. <laughs> he is grateful to you for searching for his colleagues, but he doesn't look relieved. With a long pause, he straightens his glasses and explains, I'm afraid I must apologise. There's something I didn't mention to you earlier. Dr. Armitage then spins a tale you would scarcely believe had it not been for the harrowing experiences that night. In your campaign log, recorded that investigators rescued Dr. Armitage. 
But no, we didn't. <laughs> no, we did. We we rescued him from the no power. We rescued yep. him from his wine. Yeah, Anyone investigator may choose to add Doctor Henry Armitage to his or her deck. This card does not count towards investigator's deck size. The story continues in scenario two: the Miskatonic Museum. That's it. Doctor Armitage, I like. Let's see, do. If you draw a card, discard that card and exhaust him to gain three resources. Oh, that doesn't sound so bad for you. No, I think it's probably the best for you. Me? Well, because yeah. you've got a lot of card draw, right? Yeah. I do. And I'm pretty reliant on Peter anyway, so... Yeah. Oh, yeah, okay, because he takes he, up your ally slot. slot. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, so we'll sort that out. <laughs> Done. hidden in there. The end. Where is uh, Armitage? Oh, Who, yeah. knows? <laughs> Who knows? Who knows? Uh, all over the well, dream. You see, this is why you should use clear sleeves because then you just see the lovely artwork on the back. Oh yeah, lovely artwork on the back. <laughs> oh, check this out. Um, all right, that sucks. But uh, you know, I'm going to look at what's in this other room. Hmm, victory location. Very exciting. <laughs> they were all victory they locations. Were all well, yeah. Ready? Yeah, that was well. Oh well. Uh, Barry, let you, uh, do, well, let's find out what happens. What would have happened? Nah, don't worry about it. Want to know? <laughs> Tough. Do, not, but do next not time. have it. Next time. <laughs> well, the end. We're done. Never playing this game again. Stupid. Stupid game for stupid people. We put up barricades. What a waste of time. <laughs> <laughs> I really liked it. I really enjoyed this game. Uh, despite yeah. the fact that we both lost. I we said. all lost again. But like next time you come back to it, you know roughly what you're expecting. If you wanted to, um, yeah, I mean, you know, we could I mean, build a different deck. You know, maybe someone with fighting or, or something more based around fighting. I could stick in. I've got space for like four extra guns if I wanted. You know, um, just so I've got something early on, rather than relying on the the dream setups. There's hard luck. I mean, this is the dream setup for me. This one, this one, and then either I could have my pistols. Um, a whole bunch of stuff uh, and the final arcane studies uh, potentially a machete uh, but only if I've not got those and then the last the last thing that might have come in handy would have been the dynamite blast just for clearing out those rooms that are full of monsters so you're telling me basically that so far in these games you've basically had like one card from your dream setup and one card <coughs> that's nice to have but isn't actually in your dream setup yeah yeah uh, and we got through a lot of cards so the problem is you can only have a maximum of two um, of any mm. kind. Uh, and the, yeah, part of the problem in that game was there wasn't any other checks going on. So you yeah. can't use your skill cards to draw through your decks as well. Um, so, so that'll as be. someone who's good at investigating, I felt like my abilities were underutilized in that one. Yeah, very true. Um, sucks to be you. <laughs> Well, but if we'd had more time at the end, then we'd definitely have been able to put them yeah, to use. Yeah, something. that's true. I was only... And if you had more actions. <laughs> more actions. And if we'd known that we needed to jam those three at the very start as well, yeah. that would have helped us a lot. We'd yeah. probably yeah. got another round in. It was funny. Our, our, our failure at the Miskatonic University caused us to approach the beginning of this one slightly differently. But then again, also, we got that Mythos card that put down two more tokens. Yeah, so it just if, uh, ramped if, through that. Yeah, if that hadn't ramped up, I this probably would have picked one. up those tokens. I feel like this is a slightly easier scenario if we do it again, maybe come here first. Yeah. yeah. And then the see what, see what bad stuff happens at the other yeah. one. Top tip, if you, uh, if you decided to wade through four hours of Ready City play in order to discover <laughs> the secrets of Dunwich Legacy, then, uh, you know, top tip, you know, play the, the bar first. Probably. Probably. But even so, I still enjoyed it. I still re I really like the story. I'm really enjoying... I feel attached to our, our team now. You know, in a way, the fact that we're sort of failures is <laughs> yeah, made us exactly, more endearing yeah. <laughs> to me, you know. I got um, two XP's in Bumble. I want us to win. I want us to win so bad, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> so we could actually pay an experience point and go on a side quest. Yes. Um... Yeah. Effectively. So maybe uh, next time. Maybe next I get, time. But if we fail that measure, we're <coughs> just wasting your XP. Yeah. What do you get out of it on one? And suddenly somebody's a werewolf. Brilliant. <laughs> Is that really bad? I don't know. Not played it. <laughs> Great. Well, maybe um, maybe next time on Ready City Play. Yeah. 
uh, Ready Steady Play Arkham Horror Campaign Mode. Yeah. Edition. <laughs> Got you. Should work in marketing. Yeah, I should work in marketing. Everybody says that. Yeah. Uh, all right. Cheers for following along. If you stuck with us this long, and uh, we'll be back in a, a month or so with another. In, with the more... Miskatonic, whatever it was, mm. musings, Miskatonic musings. There you go. Yeah, with more. Yeah, we we'll start another channel. Stuff. Miskatonic Barry's Miskatonic music. <laughs> Miskatonic music. Yeah. You can deconstruct how we did here and tell us what we did wrong on Miskatonic music. Well, that barricade was. Yeah, that barricade was ruined the whole game for us. That was that was the killer blow. Yeah. That barricade was the uh, blow that stopped us from uh, Fighting identifying again. the solution. Yeah. We'll never know. Do, 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 do you know what's going to happen? Is it washing up liquid? Do, 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 do you know what's going to happen? We're going to get to the end of this campaign, and it's going to be like, if you've identified the solution, all is well. Yeah, and, and it's going to be like, fuck all those times we failed to identify the solution. All those times. Lols. Meanwhile, Barry, yeah, all good. Barry continues to rack up the mental trauma. Yeah. Very punishing. Don't even know how you get that guy. Right. GG. Oh, yeah, more mental trauma for me as well. So I start with two now. Brilliant. How many can mm. Leo to the Luca take? You need more uh, mental courage. Not that I can put it on him, but just. Or uh, what's it called? Liquid courage. Yeah. Yeah, I might have to put it back in after having digging out. <laughs> Spent next. Spent two XP. <laughs> on nothing. On nothing. No, because you didn't have to spend one to take it out. Uh no, not really. But I'd have to spend one to put it back in. So it goes. So it goes. Well, maybe you can buy mental uh, liquid courage two, mark two. Ah, uh, yeah. yeah. Maybe find some of that later on. Right, yeah. done. Mm -hmm. So if you enjoyed time. this series, make sure that you uh, subscribe to the channel. You leave a comment. You let us know if you want to see more of this. Um, if you don't, then leave a comment and let us know you don't want to see more. And maybe I'll think about obliging you and not filming it, or maybe I'll just do it anyway because, <laughs> you know, I'm, you're not my real I'm, mom. I'm enjoying it. And you're not the boss of me, but you are the boss of me because, you know, right? <laughs> Reasons. Well, no, what I mean is, you know, we do, you know, edit it for the people. I don't have to edit it, I don't have to film it and edit it. I could film something else and edit that and just play and just play it with my friends. I don't need to put it on YouTube. Except I am. I'm doing it with all of the videos. <laughs> so sad. And uh, yeah, no, I enjoyed it. It's still a good game. And uh, you know, next time when Barry goes and plays it successfully on uh, yeah. <laughs> Barry's Miskatonic Musings, he can show you how to win and get all the best endings. And you know, if you play it at home and you do get the good endings, you know, um, don't post them in the comments because that'll spoil it for others. But you know, just let us know. Just leave a comment that says "We won." Hashtag We won. <laughs> start, yeah, everything. start that Twitter trend. Yeah. Hashtag we won. We won. Get over it. <laughs> Lols. Right, that was a catchy outro. Uh... <laughs> burn, it's a burn. Yeah. It's a burn. We'll be back. Rex Next Murphy time. takes one body trauma <laughs> from uh, Jenny Barnes. We'll be back next time with more Arkham Horror. Not, 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 not tomorrow, but next time. <laughs> In the future. In the future. So I hope you enjoyed that and we will see you around. Bye. Bye, everyone. These are melty. But Wait, why? The microwave, the radiator. Ooh, look at I have a biscuit for strength. <laughs> no, um...